Hi, okay, this is a very bright LED light that I'm curious to see what is inside. I guess this use regular 18650 cells, lithium cells, but I want to make sure it has uh, it has the on and has a brighter mode, so off bright the brightest and a less bright mode and it has a charging cable a micro USB with an LED that show if it is charged or not so now let's disassemble and see what is inside this cute lamp So there you go, no lithium and no nothing, this is a regular lead acid battery, the very cheap lead acid battery, I didn't expect this, this is not a lithium cell, which is pretty surprising, uh, let's by the way measure the voltage of this cell. Ah, 4.2 maybe this is lithium 4.2 volts so two things about it first I'm pretty amazed because I didn't know that there are lithium cells ah maybe there are two lithium cells inside this box maybe it does hold two uh, eight uh, Let's see, yes, the size do fit, so maybe they put two cells in this box with a BMS connection, wow, this is interesting, I've never, done, never seen such a thing, so I'm pretty curious too to understand, before doing it I will check where is the positive and where is the negative so this is the positive I will write to myself ha. two cells quite interesting more interesting that it came fully charged so let's try to open this little cover here I see such a thing no this is not a lithium this is truly lead acid battery how do I know? Because we have we have these uh, tiny caps of the lead acid battery, so this is not a lithium. Wow! But what is more interesting to understand if this will limit the charging. One more thing I'm curious about the LED, how it looks like. We have three wires, which means this is why we have uh, the brightness level and less bright so let's disassemble probably we'll see PCB with few LEDs on it if I will succeed to open it let's just all the clips Aha! Wow! And there we go, we have just a PCB with LEDs and two inputs.
run for the less byte and then for the bytest and then we have just a diffuser and that's all okay so this is how it goes 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 we have 20 LEDs that's all this is how it goes and we have resistors to limit the currents through the LEDs very simple circuit one last test I am connecting a power supply in order to see the current or the power consumption so on the low level this is the high level it's exactly one amp 4.4 4 volts or oh, maybe it is higher okay so if we are on 4.2 volts this is 1.2 amp and on the low level this is a little below 400 milliamps so now I know the consumption and how long it will last so 1.2 amps and 400 milliamps okay so if I'm using two cells with 3000 uh, so it's about 5 hours continuously if I'm using two parallel lithium cells and on the low level it will be more than uh, 10 hours about uh, 13 14 hour continuous okay that's all bye